Hello everyone, welcome back to Michael Bruning channel. Today I am your host, Michael Bruning, um, the owner of the channel itself. Today I have a finished object. Um, this is a sweater that I have knitted for my sister. I finished casting it off today. It has a nice drape. It is a Lion Brand faux, um, oh gosh, I forget what that type of yarn is, that faux mohair yarn, um, made with acrylic and nylon. I still have a lot of that yarn, um, finished my sister's sweater today. And then, um, I started casting on a blanket. I am using, um, the Moroccan Nights, uh, by Lion Brand. The color is, uh, Scarab Beetle. This is from the Moroccan Nights, uh, collection from Lion Brand. So I paid, like, extra years back I paid almost $35 for like a nice type of yarn and I've been waiting to use this yarn and now I'm getting to use it so I'm excited about that and then I'm also using this color orange uh pumpkin is the actual name so this is pumpkin this is true to its color this is the brand, uh, the brand that, of that yarn is Barreco Vintage DK. It has 52% acrylic, 40% wool, 8% nylon, and it, uh, for this cake of yarn, it has 290 yards. Also, it's 100 and ground, 100 grams. It's a light three weight. Um. Yeah, so it's like nice. And then I have a green one that I'm going to use. Uh, it's called pine or for something forest pine. Um, it's for the leaves on the pumpkin, the stem of the pumpkin. But I'm starting to use this first for the pumpkin. Um, the Moroccan Night Scarab Beetle is the background color. So it says black, I don't have black, so I'm using this color uh, for my background. So it all, you can have like a nice little blanket. The first section is going to be knitted. So I have to cast, uh, I cast it on um, a total of 270 stitches. And that is the stitches I'll be working off with. So that is, 270 divided by 3 is 90, so that is a three sets of the pumpkin. So I have the regular pumpkin, the miniature pumpkin, and then the weird odd shaped pumpkin that I'm doing. And then, uh, so once I finish that section, I'm going to cast that off. And then, um... I'm going to figure out the stitch count for the skulls um, so that I can do that for the mosaic blanket so I'll uh, crochet on that so I have to do my math so how many I would get um, which I should do the math later. Um, Nancy thank you for your help today. Uh, and oh, like yesterday for um, like giving me the information that I needed to do the math because I can't cast something on if I don't know what the math is. Like I just needed like a simple, like I needed some help and what you did helped a lot. So yeah.
I have to do I somehow have to get it up to the same amount of 270 so I'll probably have to do like some weird math whiz stuff here to match the length Yeah, so this is going to be fun. So the border for that says 3, so I may end up having... So I have 270, so I'm going to do the math for, for that later on when I get to it. Um, Let's see, what else? It's been kind of a long, boring day. Um, I've been kind of exhausted all day. I uh, watched some movies, got a little stuff done here and there. Um, I've been drinking some Gatorade Zero just to help, like, um, stay hydrated because I've been kind of dehydrated a lot lately. Mm. I'm slowly working on trying to get that bag of yarn donated. It's going to take some time though, because I don't have the time and energy to get that done right now. So yeah, I'll get that done sooner or later. Um, yeah, so I think that's pretty much it, everyone. Um, let's see. What's, yeah, so what's on your hook or needles, um, I would love to know what projects you're working on. I know I'm kind of late. I usually do videos today on Wednesday. So today's actually Thursday. So uh, this will be my works in progress Thursday. So whatever's on your hook or your needles, just let me know and what you're drinking.